The Nyon Street Serg More Railway (NSTCM, French: Chemin de Ver Nyon Saint Serg More) is a narrow gauge railway in western Switzerland which nowadays operates between Nyon on the northern shore of Lake Geneva and the French border at Le Cure, the Le Cure More section having closed in 1958. The railway reaches a height of 1,228 metres 4,029 feet above sea level at the Col de la Givrine and it is the highest in the Jura Mountains. History The line, built to 1,000 mm 3 feet 3 and 3 eighths in gauge, was opened in three sections, the first from Nyon, a town on the shores of Lake Geneva, to the Jura Mountain Resort village of saint serge on 12 July 1916, then to the French border at La Cure, opened on 18 August 1917. The third section, built by the French company Schumers de Ver Electrics du Jura CFEJ, taking the line over the border was opened to the French town of Moray on 7 March 1921 giving a total length of 39 km 24 miles. In effect this small line linked the Swiss Railway's main line from Geneva to Lausanne to that of the Chemin de Verre Paris, Lyon, Mediterranean PLM from 1938 this was the SNCF. With the exception of the period from 1940 to 1948 this enabled direct services to operate on a daily basis, although wintertime conditions often made this a difficult feat. Because of its steep gradients the line was electrified from the outset at the unusual, if not unique, 2,200 volts DC. The 12-kilometre French section from Le Cure to Moray closed on 28 September 1958. The line Originally the line commenced outside the main station in Nyon and after passing below the Swiss Federal Railway's main line it climbed steadily, steeply in places taking large curves to ease the gradient, to the mountain resort of saint serg from here it runs alongside the road through the Col de la Givrine, with a summit of 1,232 metres 4 feet, above sea level, to the village of La Cure, nowadays its upper terminus. It was here the line crossed the French border and again running alongside the road, passing the village of Les Rousses it duly arrived in the streets of Moray. The line then descended steeply to terminate in front of the PLM station. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Locomotives and rolling stock. All motor coaches are double cab. All driving trailers are single cab. B341 to 342 are mu wired for push pull operation with B4 quarters 201 to 205, BDE44211 and BT301 to 305. Topic abbreviations ACMV, Ateliers de Constructions Mécaniques de VVBBC, Brown, Bovary and CIEBD, Bremgarten Dietiken Bahn BTI, Biel Torfelin ins Bahn CJ, Schumers de Ver du Jura Leb, Schumer de Ver Lausanne Ekalens Bircher RHB, Retiche Bahn SARS, SA. Ateliers Secheron, Geneva SWS, Schweizerische Wagons and Aufzugi Fabrik YS Tech, Schumer de Ver Iverden, Sant. Qua. Topic: Modernization. The earliest section to open, that in Switzerland, continued after the closure of the French section and in the 1980s was part of a modernization program. 
The overline line voltage was changed from 2,200 volts DC to the more common 1,500 volts DC and automatic block signaling was installed. Work to modernize the infrastructure and implement the voltage change took place throughout 1984 and 1985. The St. Sergle Cure section was changed to the new, reduced voltage in mid October 1985 and the Nyon Street. Serg section followed on 5 December 1985. As part of this modernization, new rolling stock was purchased, and arrived starting in autumn 1985. These were new automotrice powered driving rail cars and matching Voiches pilot driving trailers. During the transitional phase in the line voltage, the old cars were able to continue in service after the reduction in voltage, but at reduced speed. The old stock ran for the last time on 20 December 1985, and from 21 December all service was operated by the new trains. Plans were put forward in 1999 to extend the line some 2.5 km miles over the French border to the village of Les Rousses but this did not prove cost-effective to the communities involved and was rejected. In 2004, the Nyon terminus was moved to a two-platform underground station on the north side of the main line approached by escalators from the station underpass. Topic: Preservation. The original automotrice, of which seven were built, were heavy-duty vehicles and could haul several trailer cars. Two of these have survived, restored to working order, at the Chemin de Verre de la Mur near Grenoble. Two other examples were sold to the same railway but have yet to be restored. Some trailer cars have also survived including no. B7 which has been restored at the blenay chamby Museum Railway near Montreux and another example at the Chemin de Verre Voice Ferries du Valais in Haute-Loire. The vehicles carried a dark red livery. <laughs> Gallery <laughs>